Hi guys, it's my little nursery. I'm gonna change my little prints. I sold my big prints, and both of my boys uh, were had the same name, but they do have middle names, but they're personal, so I don't share those on YouTube. Um, I'm hoping that my camera stays on. Have some type of malfunction today. I charged the batteries, and for some reason, there's nothing on it. So it's not like the card is filled up. I don't know what's going on. So hopefully this video will go through this time because it's the second time I'm trying to do it. Wait, Bobby. We're just gonna wipe him down. I don't I haven't wiped him down in a while. So I'm just gonna wipe him down. I don't like to wipe them down too much because um, this always runs the risk of rubbing their paint off. Um, the paints are supposed to be um, permanent, but I find that you can still damage them. And I've been watching some videos and I noticed that some people have some damages on their babies. So yeah. And he does have scratches on him. So I handled him a lot when I first made him. So he does have scratches. So he is my seasoned little baby. Right? See, I was so all loved up. He's like little scratches on his face. That looks like he scratched himself, so I usually keep mittens on him. But I used to take him everywhere, and people used to hold him, so I don't know if it had anything to do with it. Probably did. They probably scratched him up. Um, yeah. I don't really see any dirt or paint coming off, but I noticed that he was kind of feeling sticky. So, I'm just going to wipe that off. I don't bathe them with any type of soap or anything. I would just use mild, mild wipes. And these are Shea Butter Wipes from Walmart brand. These seem to work really well on them. I don't have any problems with their paint coming off or anything like that. So, yeah. My little feet. Little tootsies. Now, this is one of the older babies I have made. Um, and I made him for myself, so I made him how I wanted. Usually, well, typically like, um, AA babies or biracial babies don't have as much mottling as he has. But I just really, um, wanted to make him for my person for myself the way I wanted to make him, so that's how I made him. And I'm just going to lightly comb through his hair, um, making sure not to comb too hard, just like a real baby, and making sure I, if I catch any tangles, I'm very gentle, because your reborn hair will not grow back, so you want to be very careful with their hair. Um, yeah. So he has like super fine hair in the back, it's so cute. Because it looks so realistic. Um, as I've been reboring for a while, I've been um, doing custom orders, and usually people want to um, have babies with thick, thick hair, or I make a lot of toddlers, or um, I don't know. That's usually what's requested of me to make thick hair. So, being that his hair is like thinner, this is when I first made him for myself. This was a almost a year ago and his hair is thinner I don't really know how to do that anymore now so I have to get back into practice I'm going to put this on him this is pretty big um, he's a good newborn size and this is six months so I don't have too much newborn boys clothes which is not a big deal because they can just be rolled up or boys can have loose clothing. Um, it doesn't matter to me. It's all in my personal preference. So, yeah. There's something in here. Here it is. And it just snaps on the side. But he's kind of chubby. So usually these clothes, they'll be a little long on him, but they'll fit him.
to see he's a newborn, but this is six months, but it is washed. But see, it's not too big. It's a little long here. That could be just rolled up. And that's okay with me. With making reborns, I get stuck, um, not stuck, but a lot of the time I'm just making reborns, so I don't really have time to shop for my babies. I did get some stuff for his brother that's on the way, but, um, I don't get that much stuff for them anymore, like I would like to. I don't know how this goes, but I'm just going to tuck that in there because... I have no clue which way that goes. Uh, let's see. These are the little pants. So this is really big, but I'll just crunch it up. And this has a little star on the hind. I don't know if this goes together, but it matches. I think it does go together. I think I bought this from a consignment store a while ago that still had tags on it. And um, I think that they put this together. So I don't know if it goes together or they just put it together or what, but it's cute. It's cute. Here's his little thing. like his most favorite toy. I'm hoping that when his brother comes he doesn't try to take it over. Because it just keeps little Prince so happy. <coughs> Let me lose my voice. It keeps falling. Pull it up in the back. And then just comb his hair back down. His hair is always wild because I don't like to spray a lot of stuff. And his hair, I don't remember what I said in the other video I tried to make. So I hope I'm not like repeating myself. But he's gonna wear that little hat. Looks so cute. And then this is a thinky. I'm going to try to find his socks really fast. Maybe impossible. I have like socks. One day I'll show these drawers when I finally get some organization to them. But I have like socks and shoes and one for boys and girls and it's stuffed and I have like hats and mittens and this other drawer and this drawer is stuffed too. So it's kind of difficult. See I found one. I found a pair of socks. It says Daddy loves me, I think. Let's see, I think it goes that way. These used to be. Oh, I never used to take these socks off of him. I'm like super hot right now. What's up with that? Like seven hot flashes. I don't know if you guys know about that. If you're at an age where you get hot flashes, those socks say I love daddy. And I would love to find the other mitten. Because one thing that I always lose are the mitten. Um, yeah. I'm get it. See, throw mittens. I can't wait until the winter and he can wear these. They're so cute. These little booties. For some reason, I take them out more in the winter because I think it's just too hot to take them out. Um, during the summer. They have a lot of clothes. Okay. What are we gonna do? Looking for 
That's my little boy. I'm expecting my kit for my other little boy, so I'll have him done probably within the next month. So bye bye. I'm just gonna show you um I'm gonna show you Olivia's hairdo. Just knocking everything down. Like I usually do. But I spent about four days doing this. I did the braids. And then she was so good too. Like she loves to get her hair done. It's crazy. But yeah. Those are her little beads. Those are her face. Those are all her little beads and they took forever. So I think she's going to have this hairstyle for a while. It all depends on if she messes it up, which she probably will. Cause say I sleep wild and I finally go to sleep. Say bye YouTube. Bye.